With the hardware configuration open, double click the CPU to open its properties. Click on the Interrupts tab. This tab shows the available organization blocks for hardware interrupts, time delay interrupts, Master Slave Profibus DPV1, acyclic data exchange interrupts, and asynchronous hardware related error interrupts. If several organization blocks are called at the same time, the priority number determines the execution order. The higher the number, the earlier the block runs. For example, if OB40 with priority 16 has just been launched, but there is a Profibus or Profinet network failure, OB86 with priority 26 would interrupt and execute. While the priority numbers can be changed, it is recommended that you leave them at the default settings. Further explanations and examples of the organization blocks and their use are covered in separate videos. Click OK to close CPU properties. After changing the CPU parameters, the hardware configuration must be saved and compiled and downloaded. The other tabs of CPU properties are discussed in separate video.